This was the base camp of the Ukrainian military near the village of Dmitrivka in Luhansk region. A tank brigade along with two battalions of territorial defense were stationed here. On the night of September 4th, 2014, it was battered for several hours by Smerch multiple launch rocket systems. It is an extremely powerful weapon. Smerch has a huge kill zone and high fire rate. Basically, there was nowhere to hide. We were shelled from the east from across the river Derkul, according to our intelligence. Ukrainian artillery did not show those positions since they are on the territory of the Russian Federation. It is just a couple dozen kilometers within the range of Smerch. Volodymyr Kuchar recalls the base was destroyed the night before the so-called truce. He was then at a position nearby. The next morning he found out there were two men killed from his 12th battalion and three more from a tank brigade. Among those killed in Dmitrivka was senior lieutenant Alexei Oshepkiv. Alexei chose to join the military following the footsteps of his grandfather. He went to the Suvorov Military School, which is now the Ivan Bohun Military Academy. After that, he studied in the Armored Corps Academy. He left the military because of the state of his health, but rejoined it immediately after Russia started its aggression in the Donbass. He came to the military recruitment office to his friend. They used to study in the tank academy together. He demanded to be deployed. If there were no guys like him at that moment, there would be no Ukraine. A commemorative tablet devoted to Alexei Shepkiv was the tenth on the wall of the Ivan Bohun Military Academy. In honor of the graduates who died in the Russian-Ukrainian war, an alley of heroes is planted near the main building. Now there is also a tree for Alexei. Reported by Evgenia Burda, UATV.